A new approach to treating challenging brain tumours has been unveiled at Peter Mac. The high-tech gamma knife promised to improve and even save the lives of some of the sickest Victorians. Stephanie Anderson with the details. It's cutting-edge technology that's giving cancer patients and their doctors another crucial treatment option. Knowing you have something in your back pocket is one of the most reassuring things any cancer patient can have. That comfort comes in the form of the $8 million gamma knife. Installed at the Peter McCallum Cancer Centre, the radiation machine targets brain tumours considered too challenging for existing treatments. The precision is um, almost tenfold greater with a fixed frame than, it, than our standard stereotactic machines. Despite its name, the gamma knife doesn't actually cut. Instead, the non-invasive approach uses almost 200 small radioactive sources to to attack tumours while avoiding healthy tissue so patients are hopefully less sick, tired and don't lose their hair. It's really quite remarkable how low the side effects are at the time of treatment. The tumour on mum of two Lisa Briggs's brain is currently being closely monitored by her medical team and the gamma knife may be her next step. She says its improved accuracy and precision gives her hope for a high quality of life post-treatment. So that when I do live, I live with good function. I can be involved with my children. Also able to provide relief from conditions like epilepsy and Parkinson's, the Gamma Knife will start operating in February and treat up to 500 patients per year. This latest addition to the armoury of Peter Mac will take it to a whole new level. Stephanie Anderson, Nine News.